Welcome back to Infigyan friends. In this very exciting and challenging rational equation video, we are going to take up x power 4 plus 4 over 3x square minus 7x plus 6 equal to 5x over 2. We have to find out real solutions. I will demonstrate two different methods to solve this question. So let's get started by writing domain of the equation. Denominator cannot be 0. So if you will see where it will be 0, that means if suppose we are calculating discriminant of this quadratic equation, then it is b square minus 4ac. Let me write its value. b square is minus 7 square minus 4 times 3 times 6. So it is 49 minus 72. And this value is negative. So no real value of x which will make our denominator 0. So no constraint at all. Let me write here now method number 1. Cross multiply the written numbers as denominator is non-zero. So once we will do cross multiplication, we will get one quartic equation. See how it will be 2 times x power 4 plus 4 equal to 5x times 3x square minus 7x plus 6. Let's multiply. So 2x power 4 plus 8 equal to 15x cube minus 35x square plus 30x. Now I will write all the terms in the one side only, left hand side. So let me write here 2x power 4 minus 15x cube plus 35x square minus 30x plus 8 equal to 0. So this is one quartic equation as you can see. We have to solve this quartic equation. If you will see the coefficients, then it is one thing is very clear. If we will divide with x square, let us divide with x square. x square, x square, x square, x square and x square. x equal to 0 is not solution of the original equation. You can put and check this value also. So we can divide here as x is non-zero. Now I will divide so I will get 2x square minus 15x plus 35 minus 30 over x plus 8 over x square. Now I will consider first and last term all together, second and second last term all together, how it will look like. See, it will become 2 times x square plus 4 over x square minus 15 if I will consider common then it will become x plus 2 over x and constant term would be 35, it is equal to 0. Now you can easily understand x plus 2 over x is there. Suppose I will consider this one as a. So let me write here let x plus 2 over x equal to a. Consider whole square both sides. So squaring both sides x square plus 4 over x square a square plus b square plus 2ab. So I will write 4. 2 times x times 2 over x. x and denominator x will be cancelled out. 2 times 2 that is 4 equal to a square. So from here we can conclude x square plus 4 over x square is a square minus 4. So here I will put a square minus 4. This value will be a square minus 4. So let us put so 2 times a square minus 4 minus 15 times a plus 35 equal to 0. So this will generate one quadratic equation 2a square minus 15a minus 8 plus 35 so plus 27 equal to 0. Now this is one general quadratic equation 
we will apply the formula of quadratic that is Shridharachar formula. We will get the value of A. Let us find out the value of A. A will be equal to minus B. So 15 plus minus under the root B square. So 225 minus 4AC. So 4 times 2 is 8. 8 times 27 is 216 divided by 2A. So this time A is 2. So it will become 4. Now I will write 15 plus minus square root 225 minus 216. It is square root 9. Directly we can write 3 over there. So this value of A and remember our substitution. We will calculate A from here. Then we will put here. So A is equal to 15 plus minus 3 over 4. A is equal to 15 plus minus 3 over 4. Once I will consider plus sign, then it will become 18 over 4. 15 plus 3 is 18. 15 minus 3 is 12 over 4. So let me write directly 3. So two values we are having. A equal to 9 by 2 and 3. Done. Now I will put back our value of A. A was x plus 2 over x. This was our substitution. So let us put here x plus 2 over x equal to 9 over 2. First equation. And for 3 value, I will frame x plus 2 over x is equal to 3. Multiply with x. So x square minus 9 by 2x plus 2 equal to 0. Second equation, x square minus 3x plus 2 equal to 0. Multiply this equation with 2 because 9 over 2, 2 is in the denominator. So minus 9x plus 4 equal to 0. Let's apply quadratic formula. Minus b, so 9 plus minus under the root b square 81 minus 4ac. So I will write 32 divided by 4 because of 2 is there as a coefficient of x square. Now 9 plus minus 81 minus 32, 49. Square root 49 is 7 over 4. 9 plus 7, 16 over 4. So 4. 9 minus 7, 2 over 4. So half. So we calculated two values of x. Both values are real. 4 and half. Now let us consider second equation. This was our first. Now we will solve second and quadratic equation is x square minus 3x plus 2. Let me apply Sridharachar formula directly. 3 plus minus under the root b square 9 minus 4ac 8 over 2a so 2. Then I will write 3 plus minus 1 over 2. 3 plus 1 4 over 2 2. 3 minus 1 2 over 2 1. So our four solutions for this quartic equation, now you can see it is 1, 2, 4 and half. Let me write here 1, 2, 4 and half. Now let us consider our conventional method that is our method number 2. Let me write here method number 2 using rational root theorem and synthetic division method. So once again I will write our Quartic equation 2x power 4 it was minus 15x cube plus 35x square then it was minus 30x plus 8 equal to 0. Now you can see the constant coefficient is 8. So I am finding the eligible factors for uh, using rational root theorem. So I will write plus minus 1 plus minus 2, plus minus 4, plus minus 8. Leading coefficient, you can see here, plus minus 1 and plus minus 2. So simply you can take the ratio of constant to leading coefficient. We will get our base solution. So if I will put simply x is equal to 1. Let me put x is equal to 1. See what will happen. 2 minus 15 plus 35 minus 30 plus 8. See it is coming out 
35 plus 8, 43. 43 plus 2, 45. And minus 30, minus 15. So it is 45 minus 45. And it is equal to 0. So we will consider x is equal to 1 base solution. That means we can directly consider synthetic division method. So this method is about the coefficient of the quartic equation. So I will write all the coefficients to coefficient of x cube minus 15, coefficient of x square 35, coefficient of x minus 30, constant coefficient 8. Put one line over there, leading coefficient as it is 2. Now this is our base solution. I will multiply this base solution by this result. So 2 times 1, I will write here 2 minus 13. Minus 13 times 1, minus 13, 35 minus 13, 22, 22 times 1, 22, minus 30 plus 22, minus 8, minus 8 times 1, minus 8, 0. So these are coefficients for cubic equation. So let me frame it 2x cube minus 13x square plus 22x minus 8 equal to 0. Now you can see again I will do the same thing rational root theorem and I will put one value x is equal to 2. Let us put over there. Let me write that cubic equation first 2x cube minus 13x square plus 22x minus 8 equal to 0. Using rational root theorem you can substitute or put x is equal to 2. See what will happen. 2 times 8, 16 minus 2 square is 4, 13 times 4 is 52, 22 times 2, 44 minus 8. See what will come out. 16 plus 44, 60 minus 50 minus 8 minus 60. So that means this is again our base solution for this cubic equation. So up to this point, we have calculated two solutions of our original quartic equation. First one was x is equal to 1, first base solution. And this is our second base solution for cubic x is equal to 2. Let us use SDM, synthetic division method. Coefficients of cubic equation we will write. Coefficient of x cube 2, coefficient of x square minus 13, coefficient of x 22, constant coefficient minus 8. Leading term or coefficient as it is unchanged to 2 times. Now we will multiply with the base solution. So 2 times 2, 4, minus 9, minus 9 times 2, minus 18, 4, 4 times 2, 8, 0. Here we are having coefficients of quadratic equation. So I will write 2x square minus 9x plus 4 equal to 0. So we will get two more solutions except see two solutions are confirmed. Two solutions will come solving this quadratic equation. So let us solve this equation 2x square minus 9x plus 4 equal to 0. 2x square minus 9x plus 4 equal to 0. I will apply Sridharachar formula. x is equal to minus b 9 plus minus under the root b square minus 4ac. So minus 32 divided by 2a. So 4. 9 plus minus 81 minus 32 square root 49 7 over 4. 9 plus 7. 16 over 4, so 4, 9 minus 7, 2 over 4, so half. So if you want to verify our solutions, you can verify the results. Let me write our solutions in one go. 1, 2, 4 and half. All solutions are real in nature. I hope this video will be meaningful to you. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye-bye till next video. Good luck and take care of yourself.